हाय वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल रोबोशी को सो नाउ टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू बी डिस्कस वन टॉपिक हाउ टू कॉन्फ़िगर डिजिटल इनपुट आउटपुट्स ऑन डिवाइस ने इन अवर फोन उपयोग सो लेट्स स्टार्ट द प्रोसेस फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी हैव टू सिलेक्ट द मेन्यू एंड देयर इज वन ऑप्शन एज यू कैन सी इज द सेटअप प्रीवियस वन इज द इनपुट आउटपुट and here is the digital so we are going to configure digital input and outputs configuration first so we go to digital and these are the do and these are the di uh, comment we write generally it's not uh, coming in this way so it's uh, showing like that way you can see it's showing uh, in this way spare spare yeah, it comes uh, in this way uh, you can able to write the comment uh, if you uh, want to write so here you can go in detail and uh, you can erase uh, make it enter and uh, you can write the name whatever you want to in the same way we are uh, write the name of these all signals in our logo so you can see i write the empty so it's come in the same way we have write these commands it's uh, not too big task so today major task is how we uh, make uh, dodi configuration in fun logo so for that uh, we uh, go to digital input outputs so after going to digital input outputs so here you can see there if i am selecting the di i input and uh, i select the do so here is one option on f2 is config uh, it's uh, generally means the configuration so how i assign these do di on device net uh, it's uh, called the configuration so i press this config you can see uh, it's uh, when the new robot it's uh, coming like that way so there is nothing so as we can see in our last device net configuration video we are uh, making 128 uh, digital input outputs uh, sharing with field device with plc on device net so we have to share 128 so i make uh, it configures first of all you have to select the range how many inputs uh, you want to communicate it's uh, showing now 12512 so i want to 128 and so now it's uh, you can see it's split the range 1 to 128 so again is asking for the rack and slot and start so what is the rack number uh, for uh, it's the standard of the fano when uh, as you see in our last video uh, there is one device net card so it's having the internal pc rack number so this rack number and also the card slot number it's a standard provided by the fano so for device net for this controller it's a rack number by default is 81 and the slot in which this device net card insert it's a, it's the one number so i have a, so i have to put here rack number 81 and uh, slot number 1 and again there is next is the start so start means uh, from where you want to start these digital input output signals so i want to start from 1 enter you are able to see after putting this data it's uh, coming in state of pending if it's uh, not comes in pending it uh, remains in invalid if i am putting here uh, something wrong data that time it's uh, remain invalid so that means you are not uh, putting the right data so it means uh, if uh, remains in continue invalid state that time uh, you understand uh, you are not putting the right data during this uh, communication configuration so i put here slot number 1 and uh, start wait uh, you can also put from where you want to start so we want to start from the one number so i put the here start signal one number so it's uh, going in pending state so after that you press the function key there is one option you can go to next there is one option is save you press the enter save so uh, my setting going to be save inside after that you have to make the power on off so there is one option you can see the when i pressing the function key go to next page 
there is a cycle power so I press the cycle power so cycle power you want to yes yes so it's uh, going to be uh, power on off or you can maybe directly off from the controller whatever you want to you feel easy you can do from there also you can make from the controller power on off it's a uh, you can also make from this control power on off key is there so which is suitable for you uh, you can choose both options are there you can directly maybe uh, make power on off from the controller main controller so now wait uh, to power on the system if you like this video please subscribe and like and share to other your friends and having any doubt and you require more video please write me message or write in comment so now uh, where uh, you go to configuration and now you see the system is activated now our signals are activated so now communication of DODI on the device net uh, is going to be on you can check with the fill device by uh, here going in monitor you can uh, make it on off and check uh, with the fill device it's going to be on or off in the same way you have to do for inputs uh, if I am selecting the input in the same way there is also configuration for DI have to do the same for DO also have to do the same so for DI uh, it's already we there you can see it's uh, making one partition 1 to 64 rack number 1 slot number 1 start pit 1 and another uh, it's a start from 65 to 128 rack number 1 and start going to be from 65 you can also be um, this is the same you can directly assign 1 to 28 or you can assign by portion but it's uh, having the same continuous one and if uh, from uh, start 65 it's assigned here from 65 so 1 to 28 continue uh, communication of the signals on device net have been configured thank you for watching my this video like and subscribe my channel